In today's lesson, I'm going to teach you how to play a train beat, or as I like to refer to it as a redneck beat. Okay, so for the train beat, I've broken it down into four steps. Step one, we're just going to play 16th notes, one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and on the snare drum, okay? There are accented notes involved on all of the ands, but I often find that younger drummers or less experienced may not be uh, used to playing the accents opposite the bass drum. So we'll play it first without the accents. Uh, if you can play accents already on the ands, that's fine, as you can see in the notation. But first step, 16th notes, nice and straight on the snare drum. Okay, here we go. And now step two, we're going to add the bass drum. Bass drum is just four on the floor on beat one, beat two, beat three, beat four. Okay, again, so if you've added accents and you're happy with that, keep the accents in on the ands. And if you haven't added the accents, that's fine, we'll get to it. So we're playing snare drum, 16th notes, and now we're adding the bass drum on one, two, three, four. Check it out. All right, in step three, we're going to add the hi-hat foot. So hi-hat foot will be with the accents. It will line up and the hi-hat foot are on all the ands. So the and of one, and of two, and of three, and of four. Bass drum, one, two, three, four. Snare drum, steady sixteenths. Let's do it. Okay, so the final step, step four, we're adding the accents, all right? So we're at 70 beats per minute, and all the accents are on the ands. One E and a, two E and a, three E and a, four E and a. If you have difficulty adding the accents, I would suggest slowing it down, dropping out the hi-hat, so you just have bass drum and snare drum. You could go as slow as one E and a, two E and a, three E and and uh, you get the idea. Okay, so as slow as you need to go to be able to play bass drum opposite the accent. Because what's gonna happen is your accent will get sucked into the bass drum. And you don't want the accent on the downbeat. The bass drum's on the downbeat, the one, the two, three, four. Okay, so the accent on the upbeat, on the and. So that's the difficult part if you haven't used accents before. Accented notes are notes that are played louder and stronger than all the other notes. Okay, so here's step four with the hi-hat, the snare drum, and bass drum and accents. Here we go. All right, so now I'm going to demonstrate this train beat up to speed, 160 beats per minute. You might want to shout out a few yeehaw in there, so uh, check it out. If you can get it up to 160, you'll be cooking along in no time. So if you'd like to discover some more about ACM or check out my work at ACM, just visit us online www.acm.ac.uk and sign up for one of our open days. See you soon. Bye.